Here's the opening kickoff of Oklahoma, Texas. It goes down into the end zone and will be touched back. Applewhite will start at quarterback for Texas. And it'll be uh, Tristel and Mitchell, Hodges Mitchell. And the offset eye formation from the Texas 20. Balanced line, wide receivers one each way. Now man in motion comes toward the formation. That's Healy. Hand off, draw play, up the middle. Hit at the 21 is Hodges Mitchell. Torch Marshall got him first at the 22-yard line. Pick up of two. Wide to the right side goes B.J. Johnson. And two wide receivers left, only one running back. Healy and Flowers are left. Mitchell is the offset. Man in motion, Healy from left to right for Texas from the 22. Second down eight. Applewhite, three-step drop. Flag is thrown into the play of stop. Second down as Texas is finalized for a false start. Ball back at their own 17. They need to go up to the 30 for the first down. Again, an, an obvious passing situation here. Applewhite has one back behind him, Hodges Mitchell. Now he may be changing the play. Hodges Mitchell comes up to get the, the word, and now we're set to go. Sooners look to show blitz, perhaps. There's a draw play to Hodges Mitchell. He's hit in the backfield. Torrance Marshall got him again, and also uh, Derek Strait. And the loss goes back to the... Not the 15 yard line, they're going to give him forward progress, I think. So a loss of two, and it's third and 15 for Texas. Okay, Roy Williams comes out wide to the left for Texas, the wide receiver. And covered by Derek Strait. It's a third and 15 from the 15. Healy in motion from slot left to the right. Here's Applewhite, short drop, pass to Roy Williams, caught at the 20, banged out of bounds at the 21 yard line. Six yard gain, nine yards short of the first down. And so Texas will be forced to punt three and out, and that's a good start. the snap back. Here's Stockton. Good rush by the Sooners. The low kick, not very good. Hits at the 50. Bounds into Oklahoma oh. territory at the 43-yard line. Shotgun with Quentin Griffin, Griffin rather, to the left of Heupel and two wide receivers left and one to the right. From the Oklahoma 43, first and 10. Fake draw. Pass play. Caught by Josh Norman. 46, 50. Out of bounds in Texas territory. Beebe has the first down at the 47. Ridden out by Greg Brown, the free safety. It's a 10-yard pass play to Josh Norman to start things off. No huddle for the Sooners. And it's a shotgun now. Man in motion from left to right is Savage. Antoine Savage in motion. Here's Hypo back to pass. He looks. He throws. It's caught by Savage at the 42. Down inside the 40. A slant play in the middle of the field. And he's tackled inside the 40 at the 37-yard line. Ahmad Brooks, the left quarterback on the stop. The ball is at the 37-yard line. Oklahoma, ter or Texas Territory. The Sooners second first down of the game. Shotgun again. No huddle. Josh Hypo. Five-man rush. Screen play. 35. Savage to the 30. And down to the 29. Good tackle on the plate. It's a second down play, too, for the Sooners at the Texas 29. Latrell has replaced Josh Norman. Wolfolk is left for Savage right, and man in the slot is the tight end. That's Trent Smith in motion to his left. Now back to the right. Texas shifting along that defensive front. Fake handoff to Quentin Griffin, and Heupel throws a short pass incomplete at the 25. All right, third down play. First one the Sooners have faced, and they have it at the Texas 29, needing two for the first down. Josh Heupel under center for the first time today. Heupel backs up. He looks. He throws. It's a long pass. Downfield. Touchdown, Oklahoma. Wolfolk makes the catch of the end zone. A great throw. No flags, and the centers have gone 57 yards in a beautiful drive to start this ball game, much like last year. Tim Duncan, who's been perfect on extra points for the Sooners at the south end zone, will be kicking the extra point attempt. Sooners on the 29-yard pass to Wolfolk scored. Here's the extra point through the upright. Sooners lead 7-0 early. 11.37 in the first quarter. This is the Oklahoma Sooner Network. Tim Duncan will be kicking off for the second time today from north to south. As Mark said, though, the wind is swirling, so it's not exactly totally with the wind. Ivan Williams and Victor Ike back to receive the kickoff. The center's on top, 7-0 with 11.37 to go first quarter. Here's Duncan's nice kick. He'll carry down uh, inside the goal line. Ivan Williams will run it out to 5, 10. He's hit, at the, hit hard at the 18. Boy, 20-yard return. He, he got hit by Roy Williams, the Sooner. Applewhite at quarterback, Texas from their own 18. Second possession for them. Two wide receivers left. Here's Applewhite, a deep drop this time. Good protection. Throws up field. Caught at the 25 and tackled at the 27-yard line. It'll be a uh, yard shy of the first down. That's second down a yard to go. Ellis and B.J. Johnson wide right. And uh, Roy Williams to the left. 
One back behind the quarterback, Applewhite, is Hodges Mitchell. He gets the handoff, goes right. He is swarmed as he tried to go right. He'll lose yardage inside the 25. Ryan Fisher, boy, the left side of the Sooner line just collapsed that Texas offensive front. All right, two backs for Texas since they're back. They lost four on the play. And so from the 23, they need five yards to go on the third down play. Hayter is in motion. Hyder, rather, back to pass. Thrown near side. Overthrown incomplete. So let's move back to the 18, which is the original line of scrimmage on this series. But Texas again has the third down. Williams wide right. That's the Texas Roy Williams. Two wide receivers left. Tight end on the left side. Apple White under center. He's gone all the way. Apple White. Three-man rush, drop back, pretty good protection throws. Caught by Hodges Mitchell at the 24, 25, 28. Has the first down. Great effort by Hodges Mitchell. So it's a 13-yard pickup. Texas has its first first down at their own 31-yard line. An eye formation now, the straight eye, which you don't see much anymore. Handoff goes to Hodges Mitchell. Boom! Well, they just clobbered him. That was Kalmus and Torrance Marshall just crash unloaded on Hodges Mitchell. Line of scrimmage at 31. I think that's exactly where he ends up. Up, maybe a half yard back from there. All right now the Sooners are really making a statement against the Texas run. If they can keep that doing, that's going to be in their favor. Wide to the right goes Montrell Flowers. Two wide receivers left. That's Healy. And uh, fullback Trissel is also out to the left. Way out to the left. Hodges Mitchell behind Apple White from the 31. Back to pass. Apple White rolls out of the pocket. He's being chased. He throws it away, I believe. All right, it's third and ten. Texas there. They're probably uh, going to get a blitz. Texas is one for two on third down conversions. Here's Apple White, four-man rush pass, caught at the 38, and uh, the tight end Jones makes the catch. He'll be short at the first down, I believe, but it'll be very, very close. Maybe a yard shy in the area of the 40, 41 and a half. Gets a good spot. Gets a real good spot. But it is a yard short. Let's see if there's a fake, Murr. What do you think? Uh, I wouldn't think so, but uh, you never know. This is such an obvious situation. You really don't expect to see a fake it. Stockton gets the kick off against the breeze. J.T. Thatcher lets it hit at the 29 in Sooner Territory. Takes a Texas bounce downfield and will roll dead at about the 23. And we're going to have a timeout. 36-yard punt. We have a timeout. Sooner 7, Texas nothing. Eight minutes to go first quarter. This is the Oklahoma Sooner Network. Uh, Apple in the shotgun. The Sooners uh, had already had already called the play over here when they were talking to their coaches, so no huddle. So everybody's lined up waiting for the referee to signal play, waiting on the TV coverage. Ball is at the Oklahoma 23, first and 10. Sooners lead 7-0, eight minutes to go first quarter. From the shotgun, blitz is on. Hypo loves a pass, knocked away on a nice defensive play by Kalen Thornton. Second down 10 for the Sooners at their own 23-yard line. It's only the second incompletion for Hypo today. Texas has six defensive backs in now. Split backs behind Hypel is under center. Hands the ball off. Luttrell gets nowhere. Corey Redding, the defensive end, got him. He's jumping up and down. Corey Redding from Houston, Texas, North Shore. This is the second center possession. Wolfolk is to the left. Fagan is to the right. Trent Smith tight end on the right. Third down play, shotgun formation from the Oklahoma 23. The blitz is on for Texas. Heupel finds some daylight, throws a quick pass. Caught up the 29, McGriffin, 30, has the first down. What a great ad-lib play there as Heupel faked like he was going to run with it then stopped and fired a pass to Griffin who made a nice grab of that ball. And uh, Griffin gets up for the first down across the 35 to the 46 or 7. And the Sooners have their fourth first down. Three wide receivers to the left and one to the right. That's the tight end. And Heupel turns around inside handoff. Latrell gets nowhere. Loses the yard. And so uh, here's a replacement as Griffin's back in the lineup replacing Latrell. Second 12 from the Oklahoma 35. Sooners leading 7-0 first period. Heupel from the shotgun. Blitz is on. Shovel pass. Complete to the 33. To Griffin to the 40. To his left at the 45. 50. Down to the Texas 30. 45. All the way down to the 40-yard line. What a great run by Quentin Griffin. Nice tackle by Nathan Basher. One of those extra defensive backs. 25 yards on the run on the shovel pass, which actually is a run. What an announcement. Ball is at the Texas 40. First and 10 after that gain of 25 yards. Fourth, the uh, fifth first down for the Sooners. In motion is Fagan from right to left. Under center is Heupel. Turns. A sweet pitch to the right side. Coming to the 40 is Griffin. 35. Latrell blocking in front of him. He gets down close to the 31-yard line. 
And it may be even closer to the 30 uh, than the 31. There's three linemen, two linebackers, and six defensive backs in there for Texas. And it's second down, half a yard to go from the Texas 31. Heupel on the keeper, and he just, the quarterback keeper gets the first down easily to the 28. That was just a given. And it's Wolfolk and Mackey wide left. The rain picking up, Mark Matthew tells us in her intercom. Fagan wide to the right. And Matt Anderson tied in on the right side as well. Shotgun formation from the Texas 28. Blitz is on. Heupel lobs a pass downfield. And Anderson makes a great catch at the 10-yard line. He's tackled at the 8-yard line. What a catch by Matt Anderson. He beat Dakari Pearson, one of the free sa- one of the, uh, the free safety. They had six defensive backs. And wow, what a catch by Matt Anderson. Seventh first down, first and goal from the 8 under center is Heupel. Sooners have an unusual slot formation to the right. Hypo lobs a pass, caught at the five, and into the end zone, or is he shy of it? He's shy of it just by at the one. Well, that was... Uh it was very, very close. Trent Smith caught the ball at about the four and looked as though he may have broken the plane, but not so according to the officials. Again, the slot formation to the right. Heupel, under center Latrell is behind Heupel, who looks over the defense. Second goal from the one. Timeout is taken. Heupel wants to talk it over. Come out without a huddle. At, uh, they have uh, split backs, Latrell and Griffin, and there's Hypo sneaking right side, and he didn't make it. It looked like he tried to go left and was pushed back to the right and didn't make it. So it'll be third and goal from the Texas 1. Now we're going to go third and goal from the Texas 1. Sooners leading 7-0, 3.43 to go first period. Slot formation to the right side, and wide receiver left. Hypo may want to pass for it. He rolls down the line. Option play. Pitches to Griffin. He's into the end zone for the touchdown. How about them apples? The option play. Okay, you folks that wanted the option, there it is. That is a that was a great seal block by Frank Romero. He cut the end off, and Griffin did a great job getting in. That was a great drive from the 23 in Sooner Territory. 12 plays. Ball down. Kick in the air, and it's good. Timeout on the field. Sooners lead it 14-0 with 3.30 to go first period. This is the Oklahoma Sooner Network. We are back with you. The Sooners went 78 yards in 11 plays, and Duncan will be kicking off from left to right, and then we're going to go down on the field, and Mark Matthews is going to talk to a real Sooner a friend and former coach. But let's uh, get this kickoff done here as Texas has two men deep to the south. Third kickoff here in the first quarter. Duncan booms it downfield. Nice kick end over end. Taken two yards deep. Ivan Williams will run it out to the five, to the ten. Tripped up short of the 15-yard line by Seth Luttrell. We have a late flag thrown at about the Texas 42-yard line. So the ball is only eight in Texas territory. Texas pin deep, trailing 14-0. Offset eye formation. Apple White at quarterback. Sooners uh, cheating up a bit on defense. Let's see. Man in motion. Healy. Turn. They hand the ball off to Hodges Mitchell, who's blasted down by Roy Williams, the Sooner. New fullback for Texas, Chad Stevens from Cypress, Texas. From the nine, Mitchell in motion. That's Hodges Mitchell in motion to the left. Apple White, about a five-step drop. Good protection. Throws. Caught by Flowers at the 15. He spun down at the 16 or 17. Heineke and Kalmus bring him down. Kenny Hyder now a tailback. He did so well a week ago against Oklahoma State. High formation, a yard to go from the Texas 17. They gang up on the line, give it to Hyder. He stopped short. They stuffed him. Roy Williams, the Sooner, stopped him. No gain on the play, and Texas will be forced to punt. He may have lost a little bit on that play. Boy, that was a great hit by Roy Williams. It really was. I think you're going to see Texas go to some play action passes on early downs. Sooners are doing a really good job of stuffing the run. It's fourth down. Stockton back to kick for Texas. He booms it. Better kick than he's hit the first two times. Thatcher at the 50. Jukes to the left. To the 45 in Texas territory. Does a good job getting about seven yards on the return. And it's in Texas territories. 34-yard punt. And a return of seven. Great field position. Ball is at the Texas 43. Sooners already leading 14-0. Heupel under center. Two wide receivers to both sides. Turns. Hence inside handoff for Latrell. In heavy traffic, he just banged around like a billiard ball, and he'll lose a couple. It's second down, 12 yards to go. Three wide receivers to the left. Wolfolk, Savage, and uh, Josh Norman, all wide left. Trent Smith tied in on the right. Shotgun. Hypo rolls left. Looks to pass. Bing chased. Throws a short pass. It's incomplete. Mackey and Wolfolk go left. Savage comes wide right, and along with Trent Smith. Sooners third and 12 from the Texas 45. Shotgun. 
Texas showing blitz. Heupel gets the exchange. Good coverage. Pass. Caught at the, by Mackey at the 35-30. At the 25. Great throw by Heupel. And great, great, great protection by that oh, yeah. line. Give it to the protection on that one. A good execution by the quarterback and receiver, but give it to the protection. Great job. And the Sooners roll. They're at the Texas 26. First down, 10 yards to go. That's their eighth first down. And the Sooners now have man under center, which is Josh Heupel. Man in motion, which is Trent Smith. He goes toward the formation, then away from it. Here's the handoff to Griffin, sweeping left. Man hits him in the backfield. Great tackle on a blitz. That's Vash- uh, Nathan Vasher, who's doing a little celebrating with his team, 14-0, and having picked up one first down. I don't believe we'll have another play, and that's the end of the first quarter. Oklahoma 14, Texas nothing. This is the Oklahoma Sooner Network. Oklahoma had six <laughs> yards rushing the first quarter, 142 yards passing, 148 yards total offense. Texas minus three yards rushing, 45 passing. Their total offense. Offense first quarter 42 yards and the penalties uh, Texas had three for 17 centers have not been penalized neither team has turned it over time of possession 7 17 for Oklahoma 7 minutes 43 seconds for Texas Hypo 9 of 12 for 142 yards and a touchdown Wolf Fulton Savage are to the left that's a short side of the field Griffin to the right of Hypo and the trail to the left Savage in motion goes to the slot and stops Heupel from the shotgun, back to pass, looks, he'll run with it, he cuts down to 30, he's to 25, he's at 20, 15, and slides down inside the 15 to the 13-yard line. He slid under Greg Brown. Boy, that was wide open down the middle, and Heupel has done that this year. He didn't do it last year, but he's done it this year. I'm glad to see him slide. He's a little bit of a target out there when he does it, but uh, again, the protection was just outstanding. 16-yard run from for Heupel. That's his longest of the year. He'll love that. Shotgun from the Texas 13. Heupel back to pass. He looks. He lobs it into the end zone. And there's there's going to be, oh, no flag. Looked as though the Vasher was holding three wide receivers left. Trent Smith right. Short side of the field. This the Sooners left from the Texas 13. Shotgun formation. Second down 10. Heupel with a blitz. Looks. Lobs it in the end zone. Wolfolk has the ball picked off and a flag. It's going to be interference on Trenton Jammer on that Griffin at the top of the eye. Offset eye. Heupel under center gets to Griffin. Left side. Into the end zone for the touchdown over the left side. Behind Frank Romero and Al Basinger. Wide open over the left side. A two-yard run for Griffin and the Sooners go up 20-0. Well, that was a great drive of 43 yards, and the penalty aided the Sooners, but it uh, was definitely an infraction. The ball is down, the kick is in the air, and it is good. Tim Duncan remains perfect. He's 3-for-3 three three today. It's 21-0 Oklahoma, 14-24 to go in the second uh, period. Tim Duncan, by the way, on extra points, 26 of 26 on the year. So this will be Texas' fourth possession, and it'll be a kickoff this time against the win. And Tim Duncan kicking from south to north, and here we go. <laughs> Send over and kick will not carry into the end zone, however. It's it's at the uh, Victor I up the middle of the field, gets across the 20 to the 23-yard line. Offset eye formation for Texas. Hodges, Mitchell, and Trestle are the two backs. Applewhite, who's gone all the way, fakes the handoff, rolls back to his right, throws a pass, thrown behind the tight end, Mike Jones. Defensive line has some changes. Wilson Guest and Ramon Richardson at the tackles. Cowens and Heineke at the ends. Man in motion from right. Johnson, B.J. Johnson, fake handoff. Apple White back to pass. Throws a long, long pass downfield. It's caught. No, it's dropped. It's on the turf. Incomplete pass is the call. Third down, 10 for Texas. Two centers put an extra defensive back in there. One of four on third down. Four wide receivers for Texas, two to both sides. No tight end. Apple White in the shotgun. Hodges Mitchell to his left. Waiting the deep snap from Matt Anderson, the center for Texas. Oklahoma showing blitz. They back out of there. Applewhite is hit, and they sacked him. Courage Marshall broke through and makes the stop. A loss as Applewhite's tackled at about the 22. 14th sack of the year for the defense. That's what we talk about, keeping the pedal to the metal. Three and out for Texas for the second time in a row, and the third out of four possessions. They have only one first down. They've not been in Oklahoma territory. And Stockton back to kick. He gets the snap. He gets the kick away with the win. Thatcher waits for it. Takes it to the Oklahoma 37. Goes to his left at the 40. Gets outside a bit to the 45. To the 50. To his right. That's the 45. He's at the 40. He's at the 35. 30. 25. 20. He's to his left at the 15. And he's tackled at the 10 yard line. Tackle at the 10 by Quentin Jammer. And flags flow. As we may have celebration. All right. Here's Heifel under center. Offset eye. Latrell and Griffin. 
Man in motion, Savage. Or that's uh, Fagan in motion. He gets the handoff on the end around. 25, down the sideline, 20, 15, to the 10, back to his right, the 5, and down to the 3 yard line. Damian Mackey threw a great block to get him around the corner and to get down to the three from the 26. So a 22-yard pickup. Now, Merv, everything's working so It really far. is. I thought that play might make three or four yards, but he just kept out running people, and they kept holding their blocks. All right. Center's goal to go from the four. Split back. Heupel gives the ball off to Griffin. Left side. Touchdown, Oklahoma. Third touchdown of the day for Quentin Griffin. Sooners took two plays from 26 yards out after the 53-yard punt return, and then even the over overcoming that 15-yard penalty. So the ball is uh, placed down off the extra point. Patrick Fletcher holding. Tim Duncan kicks. Knocks it through. Tim Duncan, 27 of 27 on the air, 4-4 today, and it's 28-0 with uh, 12.40 to go before halftime. Let's take a break. This is the Oklahoma Sooner Network. Ready for the kickoff as the Sooners have marched 25 yards officially for that touchdown. Here's the deep onside kick. And waiting for it at the 25-yard line is taken in by one of the uh, up men for Texas. Gets up to the 30-34 yard line. Chris Sims checks in at quarterback, replacing Apple White. And the ball is at the 33-yard line, Texas territory. Split backs behind Sims. Hodges Mitchell. Chad Stevens. Mitchell's in motion away from the formation. Chris Sims' first snap. He takes it. He drops back. He looks to pass. He throws. Has a man caught at the 40. Mike Jones, the tight end, and it's an eight-yard completion to the 41-yard line upfield. Second down play. Offset eye formation for Texas. Chris Sims under center. Gets the exchange. Fakes the handoff. He's being chased by Cowens. Way back at the 30. He throws a desperation pass and throws it away. Third down play and a little more than a yard from Texas 42. One back behind Chris Sims. Maybe changing the play. He is changing the play. Chris Sims waits for it. And I don't think they got the play off in time, but pass completed to Roy Williams. And he, uh, and delay of the game, one of the uh, pass will not count. One wide receiver right, two left. Chris Sims under center. One back behind him is Hodges Mitchell. Tied in on the right is Jones. Sims gets the exchange, three-step drop, quick pass, intercepted at the 40, 35-30. That's Thomas at the 25-20, to the 15, to the 10, to the 5, touchdown Oklahoma. Unbelievable. As the defense scores, Rocky Kalmus on the interception for the touchdown. I think, Bob, I think Kalmus set a trap for him. He got him to audible to that. You see Kalmus run up there and tap those linemen like he's going to blitz, yeah. and then come running out of there right to that three-step drop pass. Officially 40 yards on the linebacker and running. And he looked like a running back then. <laughs> All right, at the end zone to our left, which is the north end zone. Patrick Fletcher, ball down. Tim Duncan, extra point. Good, he hit it. Oklahoma, 34. <laughs> <laughs> Pardon me, Tim. 35 nothing with 11.30 to go before the first half is over. Here we go. Tim Duncan kicking from right to left. He has to be having a sore foot. I like that. Here's the kick. Nice kick. This is this is a deep kick to the 10. Victor Ike to the 20. Hit hard at the 25. Tackled at about the 26. The ball is at the Texas 26. 35 0 Oklahoma. 11 22 to go before halftime. And four wide receivers. They quickly throw us past the far flat. And Sooners were not set and flags fly. Well, Texas uh, quick snapped at that time. Four wide receivers now. Two wide receivers to both sides. Shotgun formation. Apple White at tailback. Hodges Mitchell to his left. Left. And the snap back is Apple White throws a pass upfield and is thrown behind the intended receiver BJ Johnson. Wide receivers to both sides as Texas has second 15 from their own 21. Shotgun formation, three wide receivers left now for Texas. Here's the four man rush for the Sooners. Pass upfield is thrown way behind Roy Williams. He may have run the wrong pattern there. Three man line. Two linebackers and six D-backs. One of six on third down conversions from the Texas 21, third and 15. Ante Jones drops back in coverage. Here's a three-man rush. Pass in the flats complete to the 18, to the 20. Juke from Hodges Mitchell. Gets by a couple of tacklers and then is hit hard for 31. Corey Heineke makes the stop, and it'll be five yards shy of the first dead. Chris Stockton in to punt the ball with the win. Moves to his left, gets the kick underway. Beautiful high kick. Thatcher signals fair catch. Taken for 20, no problem, and 48-yard punt.
by Stockton, and the Sooners will have first and 10 from their own 20. From the 19-yard line, Sooners have Fagan in motion from left to right. Shotgun formation. Heupel backs up, looks to throw, fires a pass, caught at the 23 and tackled immediately as Fagan. So that'll be a gain of about four. Again, the shotgun. Wide receivers two left and two right. Heupel to Griffin. Gets away from the big tackler. Gets up to 25, 30, and has the first rolled into the Texas bench. They flagged him, I think. He really juked Everett Walls. Nine-yard run for Griffin. First down for Oklahoma. And that is first down number 11, I believe. 12. Terry McLemore tells me. So the Sooners have their 12th first down. The trail in motion. Hand off goes to Griffin. He trips. He slipped as he tried to make a cut to 29. Play clock is eight seconds as the Sooners come out of the huddle. Five seconds. Shotgun formation. And now two seconds, one second, and timeout. Okay, Latrell is in the backfield, second and 10 from the center, 32. Three wide receivers right, one left. Heupel shotgun changing the play. Texas looks like they're showing blitz, perhaps. Now they back out of there. Now there's a straight hand off Latrell, and he, he slips and fell at, a, at about the same place, by the way. The centers have done a lot of things right. Ronaldo works in for the first time today. He's to the right of Heupel in the shotgun. From the Sooner 47, Heupel backs up. Great protection. Now he rolls left, fires a pass, caught at the Texas 48-yard line. Ronaldo works, ushered out of bounds, short of the first down at the Texas 45 by DeAndre Lewis. And the ball is at the Texas 45, second down two for the Sooners. Oklahoma leading 35-0. Heupel under center this time. Offset eye formation turns, hands the ball off to Griffin. Over the left tackle, gets the first down. Two wide receivers right. Split backs. Heupel, quarterback keeper, has the first down. Sooners had a quick snap and got to the 42-yard line for their 14th first down on the game. Texas has one. Kempenick right tackle. Romero tight left tackle. Triple uh, receivers to the left. Ball in the center of the field laterally. Heupel gets to works in the middle. Gets very little. Flag thrown late. Second 23 from the Oklahoma 45. Shotgun. Heupel rushed. Quick pass. Caught by Wolfolk at the 45. Dragged down over the 50 by Kalen Thornton. All right. Offset eye formation. Actually, it's the shotgun with Latrell to the right of Heupel. Heupel gets the direct snap. He looks. He lobs a pass downfield for Josh Norman. He caught it. Incredible catch. Incredible catch. At the 27-yard line, Ahmad Brooks would cover him about as good as you can cover him. But Josh Norman somehow made a catch. That was incredible. A 22-yard pickup. First down sooner. 15th first down. Fourth in this drive. Ball off the Texas 27. Shotgun formation. Here's a handoff to Ronaldo Works. Left tackle. 25. Belted hard. And gets Gets hit really hard at about the 22-yard line, maybe the 21. Now we have Matt Anderson wide to the right side. The ball is located about the 21-yard line. They're calling it close to the 22. Shotgun formation. Need to go to the 17th, the first down. Get to Latrell down the middle. Keeps his feet. He got tripped up and got to about the 19 or 18. Fagan wide right. Texas makes a late substitution on defense. Put a lineman in. Under center is Heupel. Split backs behind him. Now he uh, backs out of there to change the play, does Heupel. Now he's back under center, hands the ball off to Latrell, gets a block. He's inside the 15, he's down to the 10, he's down to the 8-yard line. Boy, some good blocking around the right side. That was uh, Skinner and Kempenick and Trent Smith with good blocking around the right side, and Latrell ran forcefully to the 8. 35-0 Oklahoma leads. And knocking on the door at the Texas 8. Anderson wide right, two wide receivers left, Wolfolk and Fagan. Griffin and Latrell, either side of Hypo from the shotgun at the eight-yard line in Texas territory. Hypo gets the exchange, backs up, pass into the end zone, overthrown, intended for Matt Anderson. And offset eye as Latrell is the fullback offset to the right. Under center is Hypo, man in motion. Fagan gets the handoff, he'll sweep around the left side. He's to the five, turns on the speed, touchdown Oklahoma. Same play they beat him on earlier. Fagan went from right, sweeping left as he got the handoff and around the corner and the Sooners have gone 81 yards on the drive and uh, they overcame a penalty in the process and they score and they now lead 41 to nothing. <laughs> Ball is down. Extra point kick in the air. Duncan hits it. Perfect. It's 42-0. Sooners lead Texas. Texas has yet to be in Oklahoma territory, and they have one first down. 
Here's the kickoff from south to north, from right to left. Booming kick this time. He hit that one. And that goes into the end zone. It'll be a touchback. All right, two wide receivers to both sides for Texas. No tight end. Shotgun formation. Apple White, the quarterback, from the Texas 20-yard line. Four-man rush for the Sooners, it appears. Apple White back to pass. Fires it near side. Caught it, or far side, rather. And immediately, that's Artie Ellis wrestled down after a five-yard pickup to the 25. And Texas again in the shotgun. Apple White back. The center. Gets the deep snap back in good shape. Back to pass. Apple White, good protection. Throws up field. Deflected in the air and almost intercepted by Ante. Two wide receivers left and two to the right. Again, no tight end. White's in the shotgun from the Texas 30-yard line. Sooner show blitz. Hand off Hodges. Metro. Big hole left side. 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. And Thatcher caught him as he crossed the 50. And they get into Oklahoma territory for the first time. Hodges Mitchell picking up the yardage there. Apple White again in the shotgun. 321, 341 rather, before the end of the half. Apple White, good protection. He has all day. He looks down the middle. He throws a man. Caught at the Oklahoma 18. And, oh, average made him pay for it. So Texas at the Oklahoma 18-yard line. Apple White in the shotgun. Sooners lead 42 to nothing. Apple White gets the snap. Back to pass. Lobs it downfield. And it's overthrown and a flag is thrown. Ball is at the seven-yard line. Goal to go. First and goal for Texas as they've come all the way from their 20. Two penalties. Pass interference have helped. And then a big... Big play. Hodges Mitchell in the backfield. Fake to him. Applewhite throws in the end zone. Way overthrow. Nobody was open. Good coverage by Thompson. From the seven-yard line in Sooner territory, Applewhite rolls right, throws a pass, overthrown, incomplete. I've thrown out in front of Brandon Healy. No tight end. Play clock at seven seconds. Applewhite in the shotgun, which he's been this entire drive. Gets the snap. He looks in the end zone. He still looks. He fires a short pass. Uh, Hodges Mitchell into the end zone for the touchdown. Here's the extra point. Chris Stockton, who does the punting and the place kicking, ball is down. Kick is in the air, and it's good. So we have three minutes exactly on that clock to go before halftime. All right, let's see what happens. The Stockton cooks from left to right. It's just a regular kickoff, and it'll be taken by Savage at the 9, to the 10, to the 20, to his right, to the 25, to the 30, up the sideline, 35, 40, and he jukes and gets what he can way up on the flag. Very late flag. And there is Chris Hammonds in a tight end for the first time. And the offset eye formation from the Oklahoma 20. Hypel under center, leading 42-7, to seven, the Sooners are. Works as a tailback. And the give to Latrell over right tackle, 20, 25. Well, he gets up close to the 30-yard line. That guy can run, and he gets some good blocking over the right side. That play has worked. Kempenick doing a good job blocking in front of him. Two wide receivers left. That's Savage and Mackey. And it's shotgun now for Heupel. Turns, hands the ball off to Works. Has the first down. Whoops, maybe two. he's still fighting for it. He's still fighting for it. Finally, they blow the whistle. I think he'll get the first down. Offset eye formation. Heupel under center. Two wide receivers left and one to the right. Here's Heupel handing the ball off to Ronaldo Works. Sweeping the right side. Cuts up field. Puts the head down. Gets across the 35. And uh, that's where the play ends. A pickup of about four. From the 35, clock under a minute to go before halftime. Heupel under center. Offset eye. He turns. He hands the ball off to Works mm. into a pile. He spins. He gets up across the 38, uh, right at the 38. It looked like he'd be stopped for no gain. He got up the 38. This will be the last play of the half. Under center is Josh Heupel. And there's the handoff. Latrell over right tackle. Cracks up across the 40, the 41. Five seconds to go. That, I believe, was the 18th first down. And uh, five seconds slept on the clock when the Official sets the ball uh, clock in motion. He'll find both the teams already heading off the field. Halftime score, a tremendous first half for the Sooners. Halftime score, Oklahoma 42, Texas 7. All right, the ball has been set on the tee again, and we're set to go with the second half of Oklahoma, Texas from the Cotton Bowl. Here's the kickoff. End over end, will not go in the end zone. Savage at the 7 to the 10 to the 15 to his right at the 20. The 25 cuts to his left and dives forward to the 29. Good. Shotgun formation. Three wide receivers left, one to the right. Heupel gets the snap, looks up, throws a pass thrown to Savage on the inside, but he uh, threw it too hard, threw it a little away from him. Inside screen it was, actually. Second down 10 from the Oklahoma 29-yard line. 
Again, two wide receivers left and two to the right. Shotgun formation. Heupel backs up. Three-man rush. Fires a pass up the sideline, and it's deflected incomplete at the Texas or at the Oklahoma 47. All right, there's about five, seven men near that line of scrimmage. Heupel in the shotgun. They rush four. Heupel throws it up the middle. Caught. Oh, dropped. Fred Smith dropped it at the 41-yard line, thrown just a little bit in front of him at the Oklahoma 41. So for the first time today, the Sooners three and out. Ferguson back to kick. He leads the nation in net punting. Hodges Mitchell is deep as a single safety back for UT. Waiting the long snapper, Painter, gets it back in good shape to Jeff Ferguson. He booms it downfield, and it kicks away from Hodges Mitchell. Oh, it takes a Texas bounce sideways, and not a very good kick as it wound up at the 42-yard line in Texas territory. As Texas uh, has Applewhite at quarterback of the shotgun, Mitchell is to his left, and two wide receivers to both sides. The fake to Mitchell. Back to pass. Applewhite throws it away as the Sooners almost got to Applewhite. All right, second and 10, Texas from their own 42. Four wide receivers again, two to both sides. Shotgun formation for Texas. Applewhite gets the exchange and a late blitz. And a pass intercepted by Thatcher at the 50. He's at the 45-40. Hit the 35-30. And from behind, he's tackled inside the 25. A beautiful interception, and Leonard Davis, 367 pounds of him, makes the stop for the balls at the Texas 24. Sooners second possession here in the third period. Three wide receivers left. Wolfel, Savage, and uh, Josh Norman. Back is Heupel from the shotgun. He's got Norman wide open. Caught at the eight. He's the five. He fumbles the ball, and then falls on it at the one. Wow, Josh Norman caught it. He didn't see the player coming from behind. He hit him and knocked the ball away, and Norman did a great job. Under center now is Heupel from the one-yard line. Goal to go. Heupel turns, gives to Griffin. Flag is down as he goes into the end zone for the touchdown. The linesman threw the flag. He's signaling touchdown. He's signaling touchdown. He's, he's got it through the flag, so let's see. Offside Texas is the signal, and that'll be refused. And the Sooners score the touchdown, 48-7. to seven. I don't think the scoreboard can add that high. They don't, don't have it on the board yet. Here is the extra point at the north end zone. It's set up by the interception. Ball is down, and Tim Duncan's extra point is good. So it's uh, seven extra points, and it's 49-7 to seven Oklahoma leads, and it's 13-53 to go third period. Here we go. Kicking off is Tim Duncan. Approaches the ball and booms it downfield. It'll be taken at the 7. Victor Ike to the 15 to the 20, and he's hit at the 23, and Derek Straight, the initial tackler, at the 23-yard line. All right, Chris Sims back at quarterback. Second series he is run. Hodges Mitchell is to his left. Sooners are showing blitz. Now here's Ante Jones rushing, and Sims has to throw the ball away incomplete. It was intended for Montrell Flowers, and it's second and 10, Texas. He heard footsteps, I believe. Two wide receivers to both sides for Texas. Chris Sims in the shotgun. Hodges Mitchell to his left. Second and 10 from the Texas 23. He gets the snap. He looks up. He fires it to the left side. And almost intercepted that time by Thatcher again. As he jumped in front of the intended receiver, B.J. Johnson, a true freshman from Grand Prairie South. Roy Williams is out wide of the right. That's the short side of the field. Three wide receivers left. No tight end. Three of eight on third down conversions. And Chris Sims back in the shotgun. Third and ten from the Texas 23. Back to pass. Sims, good protection. Lobs a long pass upfield. Way overthrown. Oklahoma on top, 49-7 to with 13-29 to go in the third period. Sooners have Thatcher back deep to receive. Stockton kicking the ball. From the Texas 23 is the line of scrimmage. Snap is a bit high. Stockton gets it, puts the right toe into it. Nice kick downfield. Thatcher takes it to the Oklahoma 35. Tiny slips and falls. And he's upset with himself. Sooners come out with uh, Josh Norman, Quentin Griffin, Curtis Fagan, all wide receivers. Actually, three wide receivers. Trent Smith, wide receiver out to the right. Wolfolk uh, is in motion, or rather is uh, left, and in motion is Josh Norman from right to left. Here's Heupel rolling out, looking to pass. Throws a long pass down to Wolfolk, who it's almost picked off, actually underthrown. Wolfolk had to slow up. Two right wide receivers left and two right. Shotgun. Here is Heupel, back to pass. Shovel pass to Griffin. He makes a good cut to 35, 40, 45, to the 50, down into Texas territory. And a flag behind the play at the 45-yard line in Oklahoma territory. 
on a second down play. Hypo from the shotgun backs up. Now he'll run with it. Big wide open. 35, 40, 45. Slides down right at the uh, yardage needed for the first down at about the midfield strike. Five carries, 36 yards. That's something teams don't expect. In the slot left and moving in motion to the right is Fagan. Snap goes to Hypo from the shotgun, hands the ball off to Griffin. He tries to make a cut and tripped over his own man, and slips and falls after a yard gained to the 49 in Texas territory. Second and 10 centers from the 50. Three wide receivers left, and the tight end is out to the right. The blitz is on. Safety blitz complete. Inside screen to Fagan at the 50. 45 40. To his right at the 35. Still on his feet. Needs to get outside and is twisted down inside the 35. Boy, a great play there as Roderick Babers finally makes the tackle from Houston Lamar. Ball is at the Texas 34, first and 10 Sooners. Griffin and Luttrell are offset eye behind Heupel. Hand off to Griffin. Over left tackle puts the head down at the 30 and gets maybe to the 29-yard line. Two wide receivers to the left. That's Savage in the slot. Wolfolk also wide left. From the shotgun, Heupel. Hands the ball off to Griffin. Left tackle down to the 25, inside the 25, 23-yard line. Sooners break their huddle. First and 10 from the Texas 23. Offset eye, Griffin in the tailback spot. The trail in motion to the left. And give to Griffin. Over right tackle. Breaks free for the second at the 20, down to about the 17. Squeezed in between two would-be uh, tacklers. Oklahoma with, let's see, a high under center, so it's an offset eye. Quentin the tailback. The trail offset. Here's Hypo looking to pass. Fires a pass and kind of, kind of got rid of it that time. Nobody open. Two wide receivers left. Shotgun. Seven of eight on third down conversions from the Texas 17 yard line. In motion. Fagan from left to right. Hypo. Four man rush. Looks to pass. Can't find anyone. Now looks. Still looking. And will be tackled out of bounds at the 20. Duncan from 37 yards is two of three on the year. And uh, he'll be trying a field goal against the wind. The snap, the ball is down. It looks like long enough, and it's no good. It's off to the left, wide left. So a 37-yard field goal, no good. And the centers remain 47 or 49 to 7 with 9.15 to go. And Texas takes over. Under center is Phil, is, <laughs> I keep calling him Phil, Chris Sims. Chris uh, goes back about a five-step drop, throws a pass deflected. It was tipped by Ryan Fisher, and it'll be second and 10 for Texas from their own 20-yard line. From the 20, offset eye formation. Blitz for the centers. Here's uh, Sims. He's sacked. Scalmus makes the sack. That was a great blitz because it appeared to me the middle linebacker caused that, chased him down, and then Calvis came in from the right side. And Chris Sims under center, split backs behind him. Man in motion is Hyder and timeout Sims. All right, here we go. Texas from the 10, their own 10, third and 20. Sims under center, split backs, man in motion. Hodges Mitchell to the right. Here is Sims, backs up, backs up to about the three. Now he's chased out of the pocket, or at least he rolls out. Short pass, caught at the 20 by Stevens, and he breaks up and may have the first down. Roy Williams uh, is out to the right. Two wide receivers to the right. In motion is Mitchell, Hodges Mitchell from the backfield to his left. Chris Sims, three-step drop, raise up, quick pass, incomplete. Intended for Mitchell, far side. Tied in on the right side is uh, Mike Jones. And uh, now Chris Sims under center. Play clock at one as Sims gets the snap. Back to pass. Pretty good protection. Goes to his left. A little short pass. Caught by Mike Jones and tackled immediately at the 37-yard line. Hurt. Three of ten on third down conversions. Two wide receivers right. One to left. Chris Sims under center. Tied in on the right side. Brock Edwards back to pass. Sims races up. Quick pass. It's complete. And Derek Strait will not let him get the first down. Mitchell is the tailback. Sooners loaded up on the line of scrimmage. Sims leans in. I don't know whether he made it or not. They're going to give it to him. Two wide receivers right and one to the left. That's Roy Williams to the left, the short side of the field. Ellis and Johnson are to the right. B.J. Johnson and Hardy Ellis. One back behind Chris Sims, who's under center. And now we had... Uh, now, and then flag. 
next fly. Clock running at the Oklahoma 39 after the 20 yards gained from two penalties on Oklahoma. Texas in possession. Chris Sims, a three-step drop. Quick pass. Caught at the Oklahoma 35. Roy Williams and ushered out of bounds by Strait and Calmus. B.J. Johnson, wide right and way wide right. That's the wide side of the field. Tight end is... Uh, Mike Jones back in the game, even though he was shaken up earlier. Man in motion from left to right, Artie Ellis. Chris Sims, under center, raises up, quick pass. Is caught at 32, Roy Williams down immediately. Five and a half minutes right now to go in the third period. Hodges Mitchell is a single tailback behind Chris Sims. Sims turns, gives to Mitchell. He goes left, he's back to the right. He's hit, and great play as the Sooners rack him up. It's way short of the first down. Oklahoma's Roy Williams was the initial tackler. Then Ante Jones, who can bust anyone, really hit him hard. Now Jones, the tight end on the left. Split backs behind Chris Sims. In motion, Hodges Mitchell out of the backfield to the left. Chris Sims back to pass. He'll loft a long pass downfield for Roy Williams, and it's broken up by Michael Thompson at the five-yard line. He had that well covered. Center's offset eye will have Works at tailback, and Latrell, the offset fullback. Man in motion is Savage from right to left. Here is Heupel, the, the pitch sweep to Works, sweeping right, cuts up field, and out of bounds. And uh, the ball knocked free from him as he goes out of bounds at about the 38-yard line. Two wide receivers to the right and one to the left for Oklahoma. Latrell in motion. Heupel under center, turns, gives the ball to Griffin, right side. Gets a block there, and he goes upfield into the uh, diving for the first down on the far side in front of the Texas bench. Man in motion is Latrell. Heupel takes one step to the left and jumps over center and over uh, Bubba Burcham and Howard Duncan. And got a little wedge there, and they got the first down. Mackey's wide left. Now Savage in motion. Here's a handoff to Savage. Coming to the left. It's wide open. 50, 45. Now they're chasing him. 35, 30. Out of bounds at the 22-yard line. Boy, that has worked last week and two or three times, three times now this week. 35-yard run then by Savage. And the Sooners have first down number 22, uh, 24, rather, the Texas 27. Inside fumble. The ball is loose on the ground. I think Texas may have it. Latrell fumbled it. Never really got the handoff. And Texas is signaling they recover. First down and 10 yards to go. Chris Sims remains in a quarterback. The fullback is Matt Trissel, and the tailback is Hodges Mitchell there in the I formation. Tied in on the left is Jones. Back to pass after the fake handoff. Roy Williams has him in the sack. Sims way back. Third sack of the day for the Sooners. Roy Williams came charging in from his strong safety position on the blitz. Sack put him back at the 15, and that brings up second 24. At the 15-yard line, Sims under center. Hodges Mitchell in motion to the right. Center showing blitz. Sims raises up, quick pass is caught at the 20-yard line. And the ball is fumbled, and the Sooners recover it inside the 20. Michael Thompson stripped the ball from Montrell Flowers and then fell on it for a recovery at the Texas 17-yard line. Just stripped the ball from him after he made the catch. Trell and Griffin as Heupel's under center. Gives the ball to Griffin, left side. He's the 15, cuts down to the 10, down to the seven yard line. Over the left side, that was. As the Sooners march to what they hope will be still another touchdown. About a yard to go for the first down. Under center is Heupel. Split backs behind him. Griffin and Luttrell turn. They give the ball to Griffin, right side. That's a five, untouched into the end zone for the touchdown. Five touchdowns today. Seven-yard run for Griffin. Boy, he, there was Griffin driving a truck through that on the right side. Here's the extra point from Tim Duncan at the north end zone. 55-7, to seven, the Sooners lead. Snap ball down, kick in the air, and it's good. We have a timeout. We'll take a break. Oklahoma 56, Texas 7, 126 to go third period. This is the Oklahoma Sooner Network. Sims is sacked. 
Corey Cowan's got him. And the end of the third quarter comes. That's the end of the third quarter. Off, it's the offset eye formation from the 21. Need to go to the seven for the first down. Chris Sims under center. He's about a five-step drop. He looks, he lobs a pass downfield in the end zone, and it's incomplete, and a flag is thrown. All right, first and goal, Texas, then, from the Oklahoma Six, after that interference penalty called in Oklahoma. Hand off to Hodges Mitchell, left side. He is, uh, reaches the two, and then he is racked up there. Trissel at fullback, and the power, power eye, actually. Man in motion from wing right to the left. Chris Sims pitches to Hyder over the left side. He's in for the touchdown for Texas. He's 19 of 20. Well, Fumble the snap, but the, they get it in the air, and they got it through there. So it's now 56-14 game. The Sooners on top, and let's take a break. This is the Oklahoma Sooner Network. Ryan Long now is kicking off for Texas. Could be an onside. The Sooners certainly expect it. Let's see what happens. A kicking south to north. He kicks it downfield. We'll go to about the 16, 17-yard line. Thatcher trips over his own man at the 25. Tried to jump over his own man at the uh, Damian Mackey, I think, at the 25, and didn't quite make the jump. From the 27, in motion, Fagan. Handoff goes up the middle. That's Quentin Griffin, and he gets very little, if anything. Offset eye formation. Quentin Griffin at the top of the eye. Wide receivers. Uh, well, now Fagan is in motion from right to left. Hypo pitch sweep to Griffin, sweeping the right side, needs a block. He's at the 35-40 and bumped out of bounds, or close to it at the 43-yard line by Lee Jackson, the strong safety. Ball is at the Oklahoma 43. First down, 10 yards to go. Hypo under center, offset eye formation. Hypo turns, hands the ball to Griffin. He tries to go left, goes back to his right, nowhere to go, and they push him back. As a little 5-7 scat back is tackled initially by Cole Pittman, defensive end. Wolfold goes wide left. Hammonds and Fagan are wide right. Bubba Bertram on the shotgun. will center it back to Heifel. He does. Hands the ball to Griffin. Griffin going to his left. He's a block. Tries to split between two tacklers. Could not get much and gets up to the 48-yard line. Trent Smith tied in on the right. Eight of ten on third down. A shotgun formation. Heifel. Blitz is on. He's a, he gets away from the blitz. He throws a pass. Has a man wide open. Caught the 43 to the 40. That's Trent Smith. 25, 20, 15 to the 10, to the 5, and down to the one-yard line. Trent Smith, what a great play by Hypo. Oh, unbelievable. Unbelievable. Got away from the blitz, stepped up, and saw Trent Smith wide, wide open. And then Trent really turned on some great speed. All right, from the one, Oklahoma first and goal at the Texas one-yard line. Offset eye formation. Hypo gets the exchange, gives to Griffin. Griffin spins at the two, still going, but tackle at the one, no gain. Offset eye. signal. The Senators are signaling. Heupel says we he might, got we in. We might get a late signal. I don't believe we're going to get it. Uh, the, the crowd, as we said, it, the, this is going on at the OU end, and the, he's inches short of that. How can they measure that? I mean, for heaven's sake. Offset eye. Heupel turns left and then turns right, but saying something. Now he gives the ball to Griffin, and he got it for the touchdown. Heupel wanted that for Griffin. I saw him, sure his fist go in the air. Sixth touchdown for Griffin. All-time center record for touchdowns in a game. Bob, that's really an uh, outstanding the... drive after Texas answered and got their touchdown. The ball is in the air on the extra point, and it is good. Duncan's perfect. 63-14, Oklahoma. Timeout. This is the Oklahoma Sooner Network. He approaches the ball. He's left-footed kicker. Oh, boy, he killed that one. He got all of that. Kicks it nine yards deep into the end zone. So we have uh, Matt McCoy from Jinx. Texas at the 20. Quarterback is Chris Sims. Gone most of the way, second half. Sims, three-step drop, quick spot pass, caught at the 25 by B.J. Johnson, true freshman. He's rolled down on the way on the far side by Michael Thompson. He's offset. Hodges Mitchell, a tailback, maybe changing the play. Chris Sims from the Texas 26, second down, about four. Turns, gives to Hodges Mitchell, veers outside. Nice tackle, one-on-one. -on -one. That's a great play by Teddy Lehman from Fort Gibson, Oklahoma. All-American and All-State, linebacker and fullback at Fort Gibson. In motion. Is Hodges Mitchell from right to left. Back to pass. Sims raises up. Quick pass. He is knocked away at a perfectly timed. Michael Thompson perfectly timed. He hit the intended receiver, Roy Williams, just at the time the ball got there and it fell incomplete. Snap is high. 
Stockton gets it, however, and makes a nice kick. Beauty, beauty. Thatcher signals fair catch, taken at the 33-yard line. All right, from the 33, Nate Hibble's first snap from center. Offset eye, and whoops, we had movement on the left side. First and 15 from the 28. Nate Hibble turns, gives the ball off. Ronaldo works, left side, 30, 35, 40, and out of bounds. Second down two from the Oklahoma 41. Offset eye formation. Nate Hibble gets the exchange, turns, hands the ball off to Works. Works over right tackle, but is hit hard and will not get much. 10 of 12 on third down conversions. That's unreal, isn't it? <laughs> That's amazing. Man in motion from right to left is Steen Hook. Nate Hibble sweep pitch to the right side, but they're going to call the. Uh, or something. It's the shotgun. Nate Hibble waiting the snap. Races up, a shovel pass is caught by Works. Ronaldo to the 40, to the 45, to the 50, and out of bounds into the Texas bench. Oklahoma up the line of scrimmage. Nate Hibble with split backs behind him. Wide receivers to the left and one to the right. Gets the exchange, hands the ball off to Ronaldo Works. Goes left and gets to the 48 in Texas territory. Two yards picked up. Split backs behind Nate Hibble. Wetting the snap from the center. Hibble turns, gives to Ronaldo, works left side. Oh, he had a good hole, and then a great one-on-one -on -one tackle by Quentin Jammer. So it's third down play and four for Oklahoma at the uh, Texas 44. One back behind quarterback Nate Hibble, two wide receiver to both sides. Give to Ronaldo, works. He gets through the Mitchell line of scrimmage. Looked like he was going for the first down, and at that got uh, pulled down a yard shy. Dakari Pearson got him. Be a yard shy at the 41 in Texas territory. It'll be third and a yard to go, and I'm sure the Sooners will go for it. Yard to go on a fourth down play at the Texas 41-yard line. Offset eye formation. Nate turns, and it's collision. They fumble the ball, and Texas recovers. That was, that was one that didn't work. That was ugly. You're right. It's like my golf swing. <laughs> Bo Baker, the center, up over the ball, and Chris Sims behind him, and Kenny Hyder and Trissel are the backs put back behind uh, Sims from the Texas 45. Chris Sims about a three-step drop pass is thrown and caught by Eider. Then he's hit by Derek, by Derek Strait. Fumble the ball. I think Strait said he took out it away bad, from him. Bad, so. Looked like he fumbled it, but who cares with 63 points, I guess. Okay, the split backs again behind Chris Sims from the 47 in Texas territory. Sims, a five-step drop this time. He's being chased. He throws a pass and he threw it away. Wide receivers, so left and right, tied in on the left side. And here's the blitz, and uh, Sims is chased out of the pocket. He's being chased, gets away from the, the uh, blitz, throws a short pass, and threw it away. Two wide receivers left. <laughs> Beg your pardon, and one to the right. Brock Edwards tied in on the left side. One back behind Chris Sims. Hodges Mitchell. Sims a three-step drop, quick pass, caught by that tight end we were speaking of. Sooners have a man right on the nose there, right on the center. Backing up is Chris Sims. Good protection. Throws a little short pass. It's caught by the tight end, Edwards. Down immediately on a nice tackle by Jimmy Wilkerson. Second down nine. Roy Williams wide right. Two wide receivers left. And the tight end, Brock Edwards, on the left. Sooners showing blitz. Back to pass Sims. Quick pass. Hit. Complete and then incomplete. Edwards had it, and then he was nailed and dropped the ball. Brandon Pryor now in middle linebacker replaces Lehman. Hodges Mitchell in motion from the Oklahoma 43. Chris Sims gets the exchange, backs up. Good protection this time. Throws down the ball is tipped and incomplete. This is the seventh punt. High snap. The last two have been high, but, and he gets the kick away. This one, not a very good kick. Wobbles off the side of his foot and out of bounds. Going to be very short. Works as the tailback. Offset eye formation from the 21. Butcher under center, gets the exchange, hands the ball off. Over right tackle, works coming outside, 25. He's at the 30, 35, 40, and into the Oklahoma bench at the 42. Late flag behind the play. At the, I saw one of the Texas players pleading his case right after he threw the flag. That's why I thought it was on Texas. But Patrick Fletcher turns and hands the ball off up the middle, and that's Ronaldo works up across the 10. Well, he's running as hard as ever. He really is. To the 11-yard to the 11 -yard line with Steenhook. Ryan Daniels in there. Fletcher, on sort of a Statue of Liberty, hands off and then goes back and fakes a pass. Didn't fool anybody. Ryan Daniels is one. Here's Patrick Fletcher hanging the ball off to Ronaldo. Works over left tackle. Breaks up across the 10 to the 12. And it's 27 seconds of the clock running. And I would imagine that's going to
going to be it. And unless Texas calls a timeout and they're not, the clock running. Well, just a tremendous victory as they go to the middle of the field and uh, the fans are, some of them coming out, a lot of cameramen out there. A terrific victory for the Oklahoma Sooners, record setting as the clock runs down. And there it is, officially Oklahoma 63 and Texas 14. The most points ever scored by Oklahoma against Texas. Sooners dominated from the start of this game to the end. They dominated in the first half last year, at least the first quarter. And then Texas took over and came back to win by 10, 38-28. This year, Texas never ended. A great victory.